Also new this morning, immigrants who come into the U.S. illegally will soon be able to get driver's licenses in our state. Governor Cuomo signed the green light bill into law after the state Senate approved the proposal last night. Eyes 33, nays 29. The bill is passed. So with more now on how your state senators voted and how they're reacting, we go to 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Slauson breaking it down for us. Good morning, Jeff. Good morning, Katie. Yeah, a contested vote to say the least. It was over three hours of debate before finally New York State allowed undocumented immigrants the access to licenses here in the state. Now, this vote comes after the Democratic-led assembly voted last week to approve this. And after Monday's vote, that was quickly signed by the governor. The vote had passed 33 to 29. Now, it's important to note that this is the minimum number required to pass legislation in the state. Democrats say this vote offers a fair opportunity, while Republicans see this as something that undercuts U.S. citizenship. Protecting people across the state, we're ensuring that our roads are safe and that we're strengthening our economy at the same time. This bill is giving a privilege to folks who are not citizens. It's conveying uh, a uh, privilege on people who are here illegally, who have broken our uh, immigration laws. And I think most importantly, it, it waters down and, to me, cheapens U.S. citizenship, New York citizenship. New York is now the 12th state, including Washington, D.C., to allow undocumented immigrants to drive. It's also important to note that the local individuals who did vote on this all voted essentially party lines for this. Now, after officially becoming law, it's unsure as of right now when New York State will actually implement this statewide. Katie, Ed. All right, Jeff Slauson, live for us in the newsroom this morning. Jeff, thank you. Uh,